all right you are welcome again today let's take a look at this question on the solution to ordinary differential equation evaluate the linear differential equation x dy dx minus y is equal to x cubed plus 3x squared minus 2x we are asked to evaluate the linear differential equation x dy dx minus y is equal to x cubed plus 3x squared minus 2x now we already know that this is a linear differential equation but it is not in the proper form so we are going to make it to be in the proper form of linear differential equation so for us to start we are going to make this dy dx to stand alone so that it will not have anything associated with it so how can we do that we are going to strive off this x by multiplying through by 1 all over x we multiply everything by 1 all over x so when we do so we're going to have 1 all over x multiplied by x dy dx minus 1 all over x multiplied by y equal to 1 all over x multiplied by in bracket x cubed plus 3x squared minus 2x so here we're going to see that dy dx we stand alone okay and then we have dy dx minus 1 all over x in bracket y equal to when we use this 1 all over x to open the bracket in our right hand side we are going to have x squared plus 3x minus 2 you get it right yes and then you see that it is in a linear differential form now okay comparing it to dy dx plus py equal to q dy dx plus py equal to q from here we see that p is equal to minus 1 all over x you get it right good and then q is equal to x squared plus 3x minus 2 now since we have p equal to minus 1 all over x integrating p with respect to x we have the integral of p dx so when we integrate minus 1 all over x dx is going to give us minus ln x it's going to give us minus ln x now let's go further and find the integrating factor the integrating factor is e raised to power the integral of p dx and then we are solved and we obtain the integral of p dx to be minus ln x so that means we are going to have e raised to power minus ln x and then this e raised to power minus ln x because of this minus it can be written as 1 all over e raised to the power ln x. And then this e raised to the power ln x is the same thing as x. So therefore we have 1 all over x. So the integrating factor e raised to the power the integral of p dx is equal to 1 all over x. Hello is equal to 1 all over x so here now we have solved and we obtain the integrating factor okay so we are going to say that the solution is going to give us y multiplied by the integrating factor equal to the integral of q multiplied by the integrating factor dx all right so here we have y the integrating factor e raised to power the integral of p dx equal to the integral of q 
multiplied by the integrating factor e raised to the power the integral of p dx dx all right good so we have y multiplied by the integrating factor here we have 1 over x equal to the integral of our q q we have x squared plus 3x minus 2 then multiply by 1 all over x then we have the x so when we open this bracket so we are going to have x plus 3 minus 2 all over x that is when you use 1 all over x to multiply everything in the bracket we are going to have the integral of x plus 3 minus 2 all over x dx now integrating the right hand side when we integrate x it's going to give us x squared all over 2 and when we integrate 3 it's going to give us 3x when we integrate minus 2 all over x it's going to give us minus 2 ln x hello good all in bracket we have plus c the constant and then we have y multiplied by 1 all over x equal to x squared all over 2 plus 3x minus 2 ln x all in bracket plus c we want to make y the subject so that means we are going to remove this 1 all over x that is associated with y so how can we do that we multiply both sides by x we will multiply both sides by x we are going to have y is equal to x open bracket x squared all over 2 plus 3x minus 2 ln x in bracket plus c let's use this x to open the bracket that means we're going to have y is equal to x cube all over 2 plus 3x squared minus 2x ln x plus we have c x hello so therefore the solution to the linear differential equation x dy dx minus y equal to x cubed plus 3x squared minus 2x is giving us y is equal to x cubed all over 2 plus 3x squared minus 2x ln x plus c x all right yes thank you very much for watching let's take more examples please like share our videos thank you stay blessed